Hi, the Samsung S3 Guru here, and I want to talk about a product that I have been eagerly awaiting uh, for quite some time. And uh, just got back from my trip and uh, didn't even shave. I ran right down to the post office uh, to pick up my first order. And the item that we're talking about is that. It's my business card. Now, why am I doing a review on my business card? Well, as you probably can tell from the title of the video, this is no ordinary business card. This is an NFC-enabled business card. So, most of you who have clicked on this know what an NFC-enabled business card is, but I'm just going to kind of go over this for people because I'm an early adopter, so I use these things well before other people even realize that they're around, but I really want to go over this again. So here's what happens. I end up with a pocket full of business cards. Um, this is actually one. This is Peter, the taxi service, and this is in uh, uh, Barbados, which is where I just came back from. I end up with a bunch of different cards. And so normally what I do is I take the card and I stick it in my pocket. Now I've gone a little bit further, and I normally use uh, Evernote to scan a card because I lose the card and I, you know, it's, Two weeks from now, I'm looking for whoever that guy is, um, and I can't find them, and I get all freaked out. So normally, let me just see if I can find my uh, my folder for those. So normally what I do is I have their business card. I scan their business card so that I can look at it at a later date. Now, the good thing is, is that means I have their business card, the bad thing is, is that I can't, it's not really useful because it's in here, I have to go in, I can do a search. Um, Evernote is very good and lets me search by name, even on an image, so I can actually find it that way. Um, but I have to go in and if I want to make a phone call or I want to do something, I have to actually go in and do it. So even like on this guy here, he gave me his card and I didn't even have a chance to, to, to put it in. But then I had to call him and I couldn't find his card and so on and so forth. Okay, so... When they first started to try and automate how business cards work, uh, of course we used, excuse me, uh, QR codes, which half the time, and probably I've even done it here, the QR code is so small as to be unusable. Um, I actually haven't even tried the NF, uh, the I'm sorry, I haven't tried the QR code on this. But again, there's there's a whole bunch of mechanics involved, so I have to hold it, scan it bring it in, and then it will have most of the information that's on there, and that's pretty good, and that's better. So, so what do we got? We got a piece of paper that I carry on in my hand that I may or may not lose. I can scan it and then search it, but it doesn't actually put it in my contacts. I can use a QR code, which will take me either to a site or get me someplace, and I can put it in there, or I can use the NFC technology. Now this, you can't tell, and if anybody wants to try and get a, 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 a demo of this or, or, or some so that you can get, please feel free to contact me. This is a regular size business card. This has a regular feel to it. You would not know that there was an NFC chip in this card. You cannot tell it by feeling it. Um, I'm going to include on this video, I went to my local store whose name shall, be, re, shall remain nameless, <coughs> Verizon. And um, I had um, my buddy that that I'm always talking to and you'll see his reaction to this and his basically you'll hear him say like 52 times there's how are you telling me there's something in this because he can't actually tell I'm gonna hold it up to the light here and if you hold it up to the light you can just barely see the NFC chip which basically takes up basically the whole in the, the whole exterior of the card other than that you cannot tell that this, it doesn't feel like cardboard, it doesn't feel like plastic, it feels like a business card. Um, no matter how close on edge you get, you can't see a seam, um, and it would be very difficult. I actually got inside one of these, but I had to like soak it and peel it and soak it. I mean, no business card would go through all that anyways, but I, I finally got in uh, to one of them. So, how is this different from my QR code. Well, the way it works is this. You basically give somebody your card, they take it, put it behind their phone, and that's it. 
And now what happens is, is whatever I have programmed this, and you can go back and look at my um, my uh, review on NFC tags. However I've programmed this, this is what will happen. So in this particular case, I have programmed this with all of my contact information. So when I give somebody this card that has an NFC of, uh, uh, NFC of uh, enabled phone, which obviously the Samsung is, and about 30 million. So we got 30 million Samsung Galaxies. You have whatever it is, all of the Nexuses, the, the Nexus 7 and the Nexus 10s, all of the Galaxy Nexus phones, all of the LG phones. Um, just about every phone in the last year and a half to two years has this capability, uh, with the obvious exception of the iPhone which a lot of people thought they would include that. And there's a lot of people, if you go on Twitter, you'll see that, that they're like, I can't believe they didn't put NFC in here. So we will definitely see that in the next, um, you can you can mark my words, you will definitely see that in the next uh, iteration of the iPhone. In any event, so I just take it, put it, and I turn the sound down. I, I wanted to turn the sound up because it makes that sound. And at this point, it has all of my contact information right there so by just holding it to the phone the information goes right into the phone and I'm done now it could be programmed this is you know the, the main thing obviously is is that it's being used as a business card but I could have used this as something else for example perhaps I had a YouTube video that I wanted people to go to or perhaps I want them to be able to go to my website or perhaps I have a special message for them or whatever the main thing that you'll see most people do with these cards is that same feature so that I can give them a card, they can take it and say, oh, okay, that's cool. Put it on there, click on that, click on this. They now have all my contact information and they're done. Okay. So the neat thing about this particular version of the card is one, it doesn't feel, there's no bump, there's no ridge, there's no nothing. It feels like a regular business card. It feels like a premium business card. It's not thick. It's not like a piece of... Um, uh, th there's a couple out there that they make them with um, PVC and so it's this big thick plastic like a credit card uh, which obviously means they're more expensive this feels like a regular card and the most important thing you can get them now uh, there's a couple of places that are, are talking about these these cards I won't mention them <coughs> um, that are talking about these cards but they don't actually have them they, some of these places did beta runs and the cards didn't come out the way they were supposed to and they stopped and that's it. And everybody's covering that particular version and not covering the, the, the company that actually is making a card that you can go and get right now. So where do you get one of these cards? You can go to www.getnfccardsnow. Wonderful name. Get NFC Cards Now. And you can go there. You can design them online or you can upload your own design. Again, it's the standard business card side. Uh, a standard business card size so you can upload your own file and they ship right to you and like I said if you want to contact me if you want to get a sample so you can actually feel what they feel like I'm you know as many as I have I'll try and send them out um, but I'm telling you these are so cool and as I said it doesn't have to be uh, doesn't have to be contact information and you can reprogram these so they program them at the company when they send them out but you could reprogram them if you wanted to, and you can do other things with them. Um, they're doing business cards right now, but the whole idea is to do business cards, flyers, posters. And, um, you know, so again, I'm going to be at the nightclub tonight, and I almost everybody's got a Samsung Galaxy uh, S3 there. And I know they're going to love it. They're just going to be able to hold it right there, hit one button, hit another button, and have all of my contact information. I mean, how cool is that? All right, without QR codes, without anything else. And what I'm finding is that they are so impressed by the card and so impressed by that capability that they're holding on to them. They're like, oh, dude, I'm, I'm going to keep this card because I want to be able to show people just how cool uh, that is to do that. So aside from just having my contact information, there are now actually uh, little little uh, fifth column marketers for me, so that's actually pretty cool. And again, the same thing works with... Um, as I said, all of the all of, anything that's NFC enabled. Uh, here's a my Nexus Seven. And I'll hold that through. You hear it makes a little sound, and then after like uh, 30 seconds, I go yep there it goes, and then I go ahead and I click on that, and boom, there's all my information 
right on my Nexus 7. Okay, again, how cool is that? And again, as I said, this is basically an NFC tag. If you want to go back and look at my video on NFC tags, you can certainly do that. But what I mean by that is, is that we can program it to do other things other than that. So for example, let's say I go to YouTube and I have a marketing video that I want to make sure that people see. Uh, let's just do Konami style here. Let's see. Yeah, there's got to be a gazillion of those, right? Um, so I will take, uh, I'll just take one of them. Okay, here we are. And I'm going to find my share button. And I think I can share it right to my tactile program, which is my, yeah, there it is right there. Tactile, which comes available. And now at this point, I can rewrite this one. And it says, okay. And then I can lock it, which I'm not going to do. And I'll say uh, program. And it says, just hold it. And I'm going to take the card, put it in back. And it says the tag has been written. And you're all set. And again, I'm just showing you that you can rewrite these. You can lock them if you don't want people to be able to change them, or you, let's say, you want to be able to change some. You know, I'm I might be going to a business meeting, and they have all my contact information on here, but I want to show off something else. So now, when they get this, and I say, "Hey, you know what? This is, um, you know, my name is Orman, and if you hold that to your phone, you're going to see a, a video that talks about what I do." So they could just take it. Uh, and put it to the back of their phone and you'll see it says about to open browser and I click on OK and it takes me right to that video and would go ahead and start playing that video if I didn't have such a slow connection here in this house but, so you get the idea so you can override them they can do anything and the company will make them so that you can again you can have unique Identify so that means every card could have a unique piece so you might could use it for like a lottery or whatever the heck you want to do uh, You could have it do a URL you could have it do contact information you can have it do uh, And they, then they're coming up with new things to do and there's actually almost 4k of space available That is a tremendous amount of space. There's a whole bunch of things. I can't imagine what you're going to be able to do uh, With 4k space you definitely have all sorts of information on there uh, but I, I'm just dying to see uh, what they're going to do with, with 4K space. All right, so that is the NFC business card, and you can get those at www.getnfccardsnow.com, of course. Is there anything else? Yes, yeah, well, there's other places, but uh, in any event, so getnfccardsnow.com. And um, like I said, if you're interested in finding out more about those, I, I'm just so excited about this card and the things you can do with it so if you want to talk about it at uh, more detail just shoot me an email and we will we will jaw about this wonderful product cheers